Framed Crime Fighting Collection by James Ponty compiles the first three books in his middle grade TOSD series, Framed, Vanished, and Trapped, which follow the adventures of a young prodigy named Florian Bates, who uses the FBI's art of observation and analysis to solve intricate crimes. In Framed, we are introduced to Florian Bates, a 12-year-old genius with a knack for detail and pattern recognition. Florian and his family moved to Washington, D.C., where his parents work at the National Gallery of Art. Florian and his new best friend Margaret, nicknamed Marga, attend Alice Deal Middle School, where they find themselves caught up in a high-stakes art theft and forgery scheme involving the National Gallery. Florian constructs the theory of all small things, T-O-A-S-T, a method to observe and connect seemingly unrelated details to figure out the bigger picture. The FBI takes notice of his talents, and Florian becomes a secret consultant for the FBI. Together with Margot and the FBI, Florian manages to capture the art thieves and uncover a much larger criminal operation. His remarkable observation skills earn him the enmity of a criminal named the Bull, who later becomes a recurring adversary. In the second installment, Vanished, Florian and Margot are back, this time tackling a missing persons case. When paintings and important individuals start disappearing, the pattern leads to an international crime syndicate. The stakes are raised when the disappearance of a conversation recorded between two world leaders becomes central to the mystery. Florian and Margot, with the help of FBI agent Marcus Rivers, race against the clock to find the recording and prevent international disaster. Through their investigation, Florian realizes that the crimes may be connected to the bull, who is orchestrating these events from behind the scenes. The dynamic duo manages to track down the culprits, recover the missing paintings, and expose a traitor, maintaining the delicate balance of international relations. The third book, Trapped, sees Florian and Margot back for another suspense-filled mission, but this time they are the targets. After a series of attacks, it becomes clear that someone is after Florian, leading to the dramatic revelation that the bull is seeking revenge on him for his interference in previous crimes. The bull traps Florian and Margot in a remote snowbound cabin, where the cunning teen must use all his T.O. aced skills to outsmart the bull and escape with their lives. Amongst the chaos, their investigation into a series of break-ins at the National Gallery and other museums across the country reveals a sinister plot to steal a secret worth millions, known as the Kepler Letters. Florian's mother, who works at the National Gallery, is also put in danger because of the letters, intensifying the urgency of their predicament. The adventure reaches its climax with a daring escape plan, which leads to an intense confrontation with the bull. Ultimately, through cunning and teamwork, Florian and Margot rescue Florian's mother and recover the Kepler Letters, securing another victory for TOAST. Throughout these three books, Florian Bates matures as a character, not only as a young sleuth, but also as a friend and son. He uses intelligence, observation, and often sheer willpower to navigate the challenges he and Margot face. Margot proves to be a resourceful and loyal partner, using her tech savviness and bravery to complement Florian's skill set. The relationship between Florian and the FBI evolves too. He starts out as a mere consultant and soon becomes a trusted ally in their fight against crime. Framed, Crime Fighting Collection is essentially a tale of friendship, quick thinking, and the power of observation, all set against the backdrop of political intrigue and international crime. It is a celebration of young talent, teamwork, and the quest for justice. As Florian and Margot apply their unique skills to solve cases that have stumped even the best law enforcement agencies. Ponty creates a world where despite being children, the protagonists are not underestimated, but rather are empowered to make significant contributions to society, showing that age is not a barrier to making a difference. The collection is a roller coaster of suspense, deduction, and heart-pounding action, with a heavy dose of clever problem-solving and a sprinkling of humor. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by, by following the URL in the description.